Now, the president, Nigeria Army Officers Wives Association, Salamatu Yahaya, has explained that one of the core mandate and vision of NAWA is to provide and care for the less privileged, especially widows and orphans amongst them. Salamatu Yahaya made this known on Saturday during the commissioning of NAWA's Vocation and Administration Center, Kaduna. She explained that NOAA as a body is not just a charitable organization, but provides special care and provision for its members in terms of skills acquisition, vocation training and education, amongst others. She is well known to me. She has been an active member of the NAWA at the executive level. And as such, uh, what I expect from her is to consolidate on what her predecessors has laid and also to key into the vision of our founding members. Importantly also to care for the less privileged amongst us and to continue to, continue to enhance bonding and solidarity amongst wives of seven personnel and even those that are retired as well as those that are fallen heroes. Salamatu Yahaya emphasized the need for members to learn from their predecessors, which will help in keeping unity and legacies of service to humanity. While the chairperson division one, Noa Maria Lagbaja, said the new Noa's hub is aimed at creating improved service delivery to members of the association. This will become a hub for Noa administrative activities. I say kudos and I say congratulations and well done to the chairperson now our one division chapter, Mrs. Maria Abiyojan Labwaja. Uh, she has keyed into my vision of sustaining legacies and upholding the tenets of unity and service. And I have, as I have said in many fora, that Nawa is beyond unity and charity, but most importantly also, it's an employer of labor. It is adding value to the human society. We are providing quality education to children of soldiers. Constructed now, our center is fully equipped with office appliances and equipment to facilitate the effective functioning of the one division now one chapter. It is hoped that the edifice will result to a greater achievement for the association. I wish to acknowledge and in a special way welcome our special guest of honor. Hajia Salamut F. Yahaya, in whose honor the newly constructed Naua Center is named for her exemplary leadership and unrelenting support to the One Division Chapter Naua.